What up, my gangsters? Yo, guys, what's up? It's Dave, the Obsessed Gangster here. So many people are familiar with the idea of tethering, aka sharing your phone's internet connection with other devices. However, many people overlook the fact that you can also reverse tether or share your computer's internet connection with your phone. Don't get me wrong, this has many good uses to it and is a great way to save data usage when you're not near an accessible Wi-Fi network. Now, in order to do this, you, you will need to have a rooted Android device and that's it. So, let's get to start it. All right, the first thing you need to do is download the appropriate USB driver for your device. I provided a link to a site that gives you all the USB drivers that you will possibly ever need. To enable USB debugging, go to Settings, Developer Options, turn on Developer Options, and check USB debugging and hit OK. Now connect your device to your computer. Okay, after you extract the reverse tethering that zip, go inside and you see an application called Android Tool. Open it up for Administrator Privileges. After opening up, you should see your device listed, your serial number, and you should also see a DNS. If you don't see a device, hit refresh, and same thing with DNS, hit check DNS if you don't see one. Hopefully, if your drivers are properly installed, you should see your device listed. Once you're ready, hit connect. Alright, so it's going to launch, and on our device, we should see the USB Tunnel app open. It's going to install an app called USB Tunnel, and it's going to install the necessary binaries, and it may ask for super user permission. And if everything goes well, you just see it saying service is running and connected. All right, so here we are. We are connected and we are running through a USB tunnel. So right now, our internet connection is coming straight from the PC. Now, just to prove that this has come from PC and not the Wi-Fi connection, because you can see I do have Wi-Fi connected. I'm going to go into my settings. And I'm going to go into, I'm going to turn off Wi-Fi. And we'll also turn off mobile data. So right now, all my connections are off, and this is showing you that all my connections are coming purely from the computer. So I'm going to open up internet right now. Um, I'm going to hit cancel. And you notice it's unable to connect. Let's go to a site. Let's go to yahoo.com. And as you see, it still loads. And on the computer, it actually shows us how much data we're using. So it's still loading and everything else. We can go to another site. Let's go to XDA Developers. And here we are. So in the internet browser, it still works, uh, and we're still able to connect right through the USB. And the same goes for YouTube. We can load this. Perform this whole procedure at your own risk. So let's get it started. And apps such as YouTube work as well. As far as the Play Store, it won't be able to download. So the Play Store won't work. But other apps such as YouTube and the internet service will work fine. Alright guys, so this has been how to reverse tether on your Android device. I hope you enjoy this. And like I said, this is an easy process and has so much good use to it. And it's just a neat thing to do. So thanks for watching and tune in for another galvanizing video. Thanks.